I've got the memory of an elephant. I remember one time I went to the zoo and saw an elephant. <laughs> I was disappointed to find that Dunkirk wasn't actually a biography of William Shatner. I accidentally kicked my dog early and it bit me on the bollocks. My mate said, it's karma. I said, no, if anything, it's even more angry. <laughs> I tell you what always catches my eye, short people with umbrellas. <laughs> I put on a lot of weight, so I rang up Weight Watchers. I said, it's an emergency, can you send somebody round? And they said, yes, we can, we got loads of them. <laughs> I was actually thrown out of Weight Watchers for making sarcastic comments at the weekly weigh-in. As you can imagine, I accepted the decision with huge grace, because they threw her out as well. <laughs> I was watching TV, the announcer said there's a documentary about the clitoris on the red button, but I couldn't find it. <laughs> I was in a fancy lingerie shop. I said, are these knickers satin? He said, no, they're new. <laughs> I didn't know what to get my little niece for Christmas, so I asked my sister what she's into. Apparently, at the moment, she's mad about frozen stuff, so I got her some oven chips and peas. <laughs> it's been a tough week. I got myself a memory foam mattress, and now it's trying to blackmail me. <laughs> As a child, I was made to walk the plank. We couldn't afford a dog. <laughs> I went on a positive thinking course. It was shit. Would be. <laughs> and it was half empty. <laughs> the area in Anandos between the front and back door is called the Peri Perineum. <laughs> what I like most about that joke is that people who know what a perineum is usually haven't heard of Nando's. <laughs> Ironically, there's only a very small overlap between the two. <laughs> The doctor told me to lose some weight. I said, how? He said, don't eat anything fatty. I said, what, pies, chips, that sort of thing? He said, no, just don't eat anything fatty. <laughs> Old lady names are very much back in fashion at the minute, like Lily or Elsie or Rose, and we wanted something like that for our daughter, but we couldn't decide, so in the end, we just called her Nan. into it. <laughs> I like to annoy my Israeli flatmate by giving many posts that's just addressed to the occupier. <laughs> if you watch a porn film backwards, it's about a man who hoover spunk off a woman. <laughs> then breaks her washing machine and leaves. Done it. <laughs>